So there's one thing I always wanted to do with my music uh, since the beginning, and it's probably a wish that a lot of solo composers have too. Since my first album back in 2013, I always wanted to play this music live, find a way, somehow. And honestly, given the nature of this music, that has not been an easy thing to do. I mean, 300 tracks of a weird orchestral, metal, jazz, electronic blend is definitely not the easiest thing to arrange for a band of four or five people, maybe. So compromise is the only way to go for such a thing, but a compromise is only given to you according to the musician you end up finding and recruiting. In the case of my last album, Patience, I think the bulk of the tracks is made of a duo of piano and drums. Luckily, during the making of this album, I met with FX, François-Xavier de Turenne, who is a really good jazz pianist, and we ended up making a track together called Trampoline. So obviously he is more than able to handle my poorly written piano parts. So suddenly, having him on board made this idea of playing live reachable. For the drums, I could probably have taken the parts myself, but I wanted to sing at the same time. It's a weird thing, but I wanted that, and is another challenge. So luckily, Benjamin, who is also uh, the piano player in my other band, Itzamna, is also a really good drummer. Obviously, the other Itzamna members joined in, so Mathieu on bass and Samuel on guitar. And Carla Fernandez took her own parts of my album, so pretty easy. The last addition was Titouan, and he very conveniently added flutes, clarinets and saxophone parts to the addition, which is the best. The only thing left for me to do was to watch and probably fill the gaps here and there, change a few instruments, whatever the track needs. So for that, the basic idea was to play once, one single live, professionally recorded on video and audio, and that's it. After a month of preparation, the private concert was finally organized as the Studio du Bassin, which is the studio where I recorded most of the parts, most of the instrument, and mix and master it too. So that makes sense to organize it there. The opening band would have been Itzamna, and the headlining would have been Clément Bédou Music, and then beers and barbecue, which would have made it probably the best uh, summer evening. It would have been, yes, but Mr. Covid decided otherwise, and also the bad weather, because we were supposed to play outside, and the weather that specific day was super bad, so we had to cancel it the last minute. It's sad, yeah, it's super sad, but I was expecting that. Uh, so during the only rehearsal day we had planned, like one day previous to the concert, I did set up some cameras and my trusty Zoom H6, which is a stereo microphone, and just, you know, in order to capture at least some of this music. The result is actually way better than what I anticipated, so that really encouraged me to try to plan that again next year, maybe. So all of that to say that what you're about to see and hear is the result of one rehearsal with the complete band and in a classroom recorded with one single stereo microphone, so be advised. Even though for one single microphone, the result is actually incredible. Anyway, this is the only result uh, available so far for this project that is still very, very close to my heart. So I really hope you like it and Enjoy!
plutôt qu'elle soit juste tout le temps derrière. Ouais, ouais, Alors, ouais, ouais. c'est parti. C'est la même prise. Enfin, plus, ouais. Première prise. <rire>
Tu veux plus de grosses fesses Le kick, le kick. Ok. Il arrivera qu'elle ait un break. Un jour, il y a une taille maintenant. Et juste le passage métal. Ouais. Ça se monte. Hop. Quoi Juste en train de.
Tu veux pas attendre 5 minutes pour les critiques juste <rire> 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 <rire>